Hey guys, today we're going to be going over how to create a logo for YouTube. Um, so I've got three different things that we're going to do it with. First is Canva, which you can do for free. Um, there is a paid version as well, um, but for this we're going to do a free version. And literally you see you type in here in the search, um, YouTube channel logo, you grab that. And right off the bat, it gives us some logo templates to choose from. If you see here, this says pro, which means we couldn't use that unless we have the paid version. Um, so, but it'll tell us which ones we can use. So let's see, I kind of like this one. It stands alone. So let's just go ahead and use this one. So the name's kind of long, so all you would do is just go home. Just replace. Share. Review. Oops. Reviews. And that's quick and easy. Um, not so sure I like these colors, but you can go through here and see you could change if you wanted. You can choose a different color. See, it's the different elements too. Let's see what that'll look like here. I don't think I like that. I think I'm going to go back to the original, <laughs> which you just undo. That's a simple logo that that will work for if you're starting out, that will work. So for Canva, we'll just leave it like this. And this is, you can go through and see how you can upload your own images. You can, you have photos here that you can choose from. If I wanted a photo background, um, you have text that you can add on here. Again, you see how it's pro. Um, there's also audio, which we don't need that. And we don't, you could do a video, um, just to kind of do some eye catching. Um, cause as you see here on YouTube, see how you can see these logos. So you want something that's going to stand out. So actually, as I'm looking at this, you may want to go, oops, back here. Let's see what the background actually looks like in white. Mm. I just need to change this color. Oh. That actually, that might stand out we can try it um that might stand out if we're comparing and looking see how we see here this is black and white we want something to stand out so um i like the black but i also like this white but let's go ahead and do choose this one so here you'll want to go ahead and download either the PNG for the high quality or for JPEG would probably be what I would end up doing. Um, so you can download that. So now I'm going to show you another option, uh, which I tend to like to use. It's place it. I actually have an account with them. It's pretty affordable. Um, it's, I think I pay like once a, once a year for it. But as you see here, there's so much you can do with it. Mockups, design, different designs, um, logos, videos, gaming stuff. Um, but it goes down. They have templates that you can alter, um, tons of different templates. It says you can start creating 
you can actually create some for free as well. Um, I have the paid version. I'd never really use the free version because I had seen this somewhere and liked it. Um, but let's go ahead here and go make a, make a free logo. The biggest reason I like this though is because logos can take a lot of time. <laughs> you can spend countless hours just tweaking things. Uh, maybe you don't like the color or this needs to go here, this needs to go there. With Placeit, they have these templates. You make them your own. Um, you can change things easily and then just get it done. Um, it's a lot faster. So you can go back later, but see, you put in the name. Here it says, select the industry. So for this one, it's a review channel. We're gonna be doing all kinds of different things. Really, it's an educational, it's a review channel. So we're gonna have tons of things. We'll go with YouTubers. And then you hit let's go and it'll populate. So here it's bringing up some. And you can go in here and choose a graphic. Maybe you'll like one of these graphics or you have a specific thing in mind for your channel. That's kind of cool. You can also edit if you want to go and choose something else in here. But let's take a look at what it did. Now I'm looking for something that's going to just like pop out, but also be pretty simple. I'm going to go with that. I actually like how that backdrop is. Maybe I don't like that. Let's try. Let's try this one and see what that's going to bring up. You want something to catch people's eyes? I mean, right now, I'm not going to stop and see these. They're not going to make me stop. This is why, <laughs> say, if you were in Canva, it would maybe take us a little bit longer. not digging that either. Let me see if we just go here to abstract.
on my computer. Kind of like this, a little bit. I like this and I like this. Um, and they have pages and pages as you see here. I could go I'm actually going to go here and choose, let's go to arts and craft. I just want something simple that's going to stand out again. <clears throat> so home share reviews. Oh, this one's not bad. That one's not bad either, but so let's go ahead and choose this one. So what you see here is the text. Somehow it cut that off because they are limited to 16. Um, but that's fine because we're going to actually put reviews there. So home share reviews. I'm not liking this background color at all. If we're matching up to the other, let's just do... So you can choose the template that's actually of the inner graphic. If we're going to compare the other, see how that's the inner graphic. So I change that to purple or maybe we make that yellow. And actually, you know what? I do want that to be purple. A bright purple. I like that. And... Let's see, the outer bear. Let's make this one. There we go. I can see that. Let me just see something here. No, oh, I like the yellow. Or even the orange. We'll stick with yellow. So if we were just matching up to the other, it's a quick. Here's some others. No, I think that's good. I think this is a good logo right here. So then all you have to do is download. And it'll email you and process it when it's ready. We'll see. There it is. It actually processes a white version of the logo, which Clearly, we're not going to use that unless we change things. But here's the black of what we were using. But if if you did like the white version, all you would have to do is go here to view all. And you could edit this. Make more. Pull that same one back up. I'd actually just make these. Oh, there is something I just saw. So that was actually blue. Hold on one second, because we have to repopulate this to be white. We're going to download that. All right, and then we can just go here, make those black, or, and then change the background to white. And there's the white version, and then you would just download that. So that's going to be it for the logo for channel art. You can use Canva or Placeit. Um, 
there's a couple other, you know, softwares out there that can make logos, but just for a quick logo to put up for your YouTube channel um, or any of your social media, because this also does other, other logos. So you've got that it'll design for and you can use these in your other social medias. So I hope this was helpful information for you for how to create a logo for YouTube, uh, for your YouTube channel. In the next video, we're going to be going over how to create the channel art. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Again, if this was helpful for you, please like, subscribe, and stay tuned for the next video.